Welcome to Getting Started with UDD Profile Development. In this video, we will discuss the functions used in creating a UDD profile script, as well as the types of driver behavior that can be created using those functions. This video will assume that the user has previous knowledge of JavaScript, has CapServer EX or ThingWorks Cap4 Server version 6.10 or higher installed on their Windows operating system, and has basic configuration knowledge of Cap4. The Universal Device Driver is an Ethernet-based user-defined custom driver that leverages JavaScript. This means that the user can create their own drivers to connect to a wide variety of plant floor or IoT devices, including barcode scanners, way scales, sensors, and others. It's important to understand three terms when building custom drivers with UDD. Profile script, which is the definition of the behavior of the custom driver written in JavaScript. Profile library, which is the collection of profile scripts stored in a single Kepler project. And universal device driver channel, which is the implementation of one profile script. The universal device driver supports the following driver design paradigms. Simple solicited, which is client-side driver behavior that expects to send a request to a target and await a response. For example, we would use the driver to send a read or write request and then await and parse the returned response. Simple unsolicited, which is server side driver behavior that expects to spontaneously receive data from a target without first sending requests. For example, any reads to the driver would simply return data from the driver's cache and the driver would place values into that cache whenever they are received from the target. PubSub or publish subscribe, which is light client-side driver behavior with heavy server-side unsolicited handling. For example, the driver would create and send a general subscription request to a target data broker and then await and parse spontaneously delivered messages related to the established subscription. Mixed mode, which may be both heavy client-side and heavy server-side for example, the driver would create and send a general subscription for one collection of tag addresses, while it would instead create and send individual read request messages for other specific tag addresses. The UDD API presents four functions for the developer to define. On profile load, on validate tag, on tags request, and on data. Let's look at the four functions in more detail. Please note that complete reference information can be found in the Kepler profile library and universal device driver help files. On profile load sets the driver mode and UDD API version. No inputs, only returned. The mode, client or server, only controls the behavior of drivers set to use the TCP data transport protocol. Client mode causes the driver to send a TCP connection establishment request to the specified IP and port. Server mode causes the driver to open a listening socket at the specified TCP port on the network adapter defined in the channel. Server mode expects to receive TCP connection establishment requests from the target data source. On validate tag validates tag addresses and data types. Apply regular expressions or regex for quick or sophisticated syntax checking. Input is an object, info with a single member, info.tag. The developer assigns values to info.tag and returns the info object. Info has five properties, address, valid, read only, data type, and bulk ID. Tags that share the same bulk ID are blocked together and provided to the on tags request and on data functions, allowing the script to complete all the tags in the block in a single processing transaction. Bulk ID can be used, for example, to request values for multiple tags in one device message and to assign the return values to all tags in one processing transaction. On tags request defines what happens when the server asks the driver to read or write a tag. Input is an object with two members, type, read or write, and tags, an array of tag objects. Tags have six properties, address, data type, read only, value, quality, and bulk ID. The developer uses info to create tag request processing and may optionally assign values to tags and return tags as an object at the end of the transaction. Also returned at the end of the transaction is action, the driver's next action, which is to complete, receive, or fail, and data, any data like a request message to be sent to the target system. On data defines what happens when the data is received spontaneously or related to a previously issued request. The function has a single input that is an object with three members, type, tags, and data. Type is the communication mode of tags. 
tags or an array of tags and their properties. Data is the incoming data received by the driver over the Ethernet port. The developer handles parsing data delivered by the target system, assigning values to tags and optional quality status, and returning tags, the driver's next action, and any data to send back to the target device at the end of the transaction. In addition to the four required functions, the UDD API also supports the functions you see on the screen here. For more information about these functions, please refer to the Profile Library help file located in Kepware. Now that we've reviewed the UDD functions and communication paradigms, the next video will show the completion of a simple UDD profile, loading the profile into the library, and then implementing that profile to connect to your target device.